Hey everyone, here I am with a Windows 95 virtual machine. I'm using Windows 95 version B. So, with this video, we're going to be talking about a fix for those of you who got Plus 95 installed and you installed either a later version of Internet Explorer or, off, or either Office 97 or Office 2000, for instance. Let's say you have what I what I did was after I installed Plus for Windows 95, I went ahead and installed IE4 with Windows Desktop Update, then up to IE 5.5, and also installed Office 2000. But there's a little problem that desktop themes do when you go to change a theme in Windows 95. Let's say, for example, you want to do the more Windows theme, and you get this error message saying that themes.exe performed an illegal operation but when you install a later version of it either like IE4 or above or or Microsoft Office 97 or later it has something to do with the compatibility of the JPG files or and some of the image files but Microsoft actually released a fix to resolve the desktop themes issue which causes that error message and you may notice on the desktop that themes.exe file is actually the revised version of desktop themes but you could download it from theme world which is still available but um, I'm not sure if it's still on the Microsoft website because I know Microsoft had had it available for download but if you don't have access to the Microsoft site if you have a copy of plus for kids which I have a um, copy of plus for kids installed but even though Microsoft does not recommend you installing but have installing over plus 95 and um, with, with plus for kids so in the Steam folder, it's even got a even got the actual revised version of desktop themes. So uh, as an example, I'm gonna show you a little something here. We'll see. As I go to choose a theme and with this version of desktop as you see you get no problem well you can either copy the file or you can copy the file from the um, plus for kids disk over to the um, plus folder but what I'm gonna be doing here is a little experiment so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into the um, pro let's go to C program files plus and you can see the themes folder right here the themes file but we're going to rename that we're going to put make sure rename it as themes.old this is version 4.4.310 4. we're going to rename it themes.old We're going to cut over and paste the um, new file over. And this is the newer version of themes, of course. This is version 4.04. .04. I mean 4.40.311. Oh, uh, this one is version 3 4.0. I mean 4.40310. So let's go ahead and open up open up desktop themes again in control panel. And see? And there you have it. You're able to change themes, of course.
And I hope this video helped help some of you guys out that are trying to get your Windows 95 virtual machines up and going. And plus, this is, will save you a lot of time too, instead of um, uninstalling and reinstalling Plus, because a lot there's a reason Microsoft doesn't really rec doesn't recommend installing if you have the uh, Windows Desktop Update installed and installing over the Desktop Update with Plus, because due to because it does it. I don't know, have some type of interference with the icon shell. So, but the be but I I personally recommend using Plus for Windows ninety five without the Windows Desktop update if you're using Windows ninety five. So, I'm gonna leave a link down in the description for the themes.exe file. But you might want to put it on an ISO to, if you're going to put it in your Windows 95 virtual machine or Windows 95 PC, which you can basically burn it on a disk. So, hope to see you guys on the next video, and thanks for watching.